What about now? All right. Okay. Good morning. All right. It's so good to see you this morning. So this morning, we are going to hear a story about Jesus. And I brought my children's Bible this morning. And one of the reasons that we read our Bible, there are a lot of reasons, but one of them is because the Bible tells us a lot of God's stories. And the Bible tells us lots of stories about Jesus' life. And I brought my children's Bible this morning because I wanted you to see the picture of the story that we are going to hear about this morning. Do you see this picture? It's a picture of Jesus preaching to a big crowd. Kind of like how Reverend Becky and Reverend Alston preached to a big crowd here. And in this story, Jesus tells these people all kinds of ways that they can love God. And he tells them all the ways that God loves us. And in this sermon, Jesus talks about that we call Jesus Lord, right? We call Jesus our Lord. And because Jesus is our Lord, we do lots of things that Jesus tells us. Because Jesus gives us really simple instructions. What are some of the ways Jesus tells us that we should love each other? Yeah, Rosemary. How can you love, how can you love each other, you think? By saying kind words. Great. Teddy. By sharing. Great. So we read all of these stories because Jesus teaches us how to love each other, right? And one of the ways that we love Jesus and we love each other is that we pray together. We pray to Jesus, who is our Lord. So can we all pray together this morning? All right, let's say a prayer. Maybe the grown-ups can pray with us, too. Okay. Let's pray. Good morning, God. Thank you for loving us and teaching us how to love each other. Jesus is our Lord. And we are so grateful. Amen. All right. If you are younger than first grade, you can go with Miss Sarah Kate to Children's Church. All right. 